Good afternoon, everybody. It's your old buddy Jim and his lazy dog Rosie. Oop, about lost my camera. Hope everybody's having a good weekend. I have so far. So, just uh, figured I'd get down here and talk about the Fuhrer speech from the other night. Wasn't that expected? Man, he, of course, tries to walk back what he said, but they're serious. Uh, they're trying to incite and divide the great unifier. It's done nothing but divide. So, I guess if uh, anybody don't agree with the agenda they're pushing, you're automatically an enemy of the state now. So, that's just what I think. And we're so divided now, I don't know if we'll ever come back from it. No potato head. When they pump him up on his meds, he sure doesn't help things, does he? I guess he was trying to scare people, but I got news for him. Ain't nobody scared of you. So, if you don't go along with the, the agenda, the communist agenda, the Green New Scam, which, you know, California just outlawed electric or gas-powered cars here, few years well, what are they telling people now with the few they have out there don't charge them up Greg can you handle it if people don't see the stupidity of this I just don't understand what planet they're from or what goes on in their little pea brains because it doesn't make any sense to me none of it does so just keep uh, keep uh, keep your eyes open uh, you need to pay attention to the little things like this because they don't take the bait. They're trying to, to get somebody to do something stupid if they don't set it up and do it themselves and then blame it on their political opposition. So it's perilous times we live in here. If you're a constitutionalist and you agree with the Constitution, you're an extremist. If you go to church, you might be an extremist. If you have more than a couple of days food put back, you're probably an extremist. If you don't agree with everything that comes from the Ministry of Truth mouths, you're probably an extremist. Well, I guess I'm guilty on a lot of that. So, it is National Preparedness Month. And I've been going through and I organized all my medical preps. And I can tell you right now that I'm not where I need to be on that by a long shot. So, looks like I'll be going out and looking for some more stuff to supplement those. I do have a, a bare eye fact from Refuge Medical and I really, I really like that. And I've been saying it for a while, but I need to go to the American Red Cross and take a first aid class. I'd like to take one from Bear Independent or Patriot Nurse, but just uh, don't, don't have that much free time. Too far to drive, I guess. But I am weak on my medical preparedness, so I need to address that situation. But anywho, it's not a bad day here in Upper East Tennessee. So, oh, that's another thing that'll make you extremist if you fly Old Glory. So, looks like we got a lot of extremists here in my little area, doesn't it? So, just keep your head on a swivel. Try to discern all this crazy information that's coming at us at a thousand miles an hour the best you can. Just keep on preparing, keep on getting ready. Keep being an extremist, I guess. Don't take the bait, that speech was designed to piss us off, intimidate us, scare us. And it did tee me off a little bit, but it definitely didn't scare me. And it's designed to fire up his radical base. So, the brown shirts of Antifa, I guess, will come out in full force here pretty soon. Luckily, we don't have that problem here where I live, although I would like to see them bus a few of them in, see how, see how long they last. It wouldn't be long if somebody 
kick their hind end up between their shoulder blades if I had to guess. They don't do well in one-on-one -on -one situations or when the odds are even. They prefer to get a gang of them around some old people and do it that way. Cowards is what they are. So that's it for today. I'm still planning on grilling wings and making some jalapeno poppers. Maybe some chili cheese fries. So y'all be careful. Enjoy your weekend. Uh, it is preparing this month, so uh, get out there and, and get prepared. See where your week at. See what you're, you need to, to shore up. And just do the best you can where you're at with what you got is all I can tell you to do. I'm not in an ideal location, but I'm trying to make the best of it. So if you have land, that's even better. If you have a mag, that's wonderful. Right now I don't have either, so I've got a loose mag, loosely affiliated, so we'll see how that goes. But uh, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch the videos. Have a great weekend. Leave a comment, shoot a thumbs up, and don't let the fewer intimidate or scare you. That's what it was designed to do, and he ain't scaring nobody. So y'all have a wonderful weekend. Adios, amigos.